G'day Wallaby Snag, welcome to the Bass Strait. Not a breath of wind, just breath of whales that we've been chasing all morning and we haven't found anything on the tuna gear. So it's time to have a bit of a bait fish. Hello Pickle. I'm baiting. Yeah. Here's the, baiting. Ma the master baiter. We're gonna see if we can find some fish to put in the bin, load up. Got some signs here. So come along for the journey. I'm gonna have a jig, Nick's gonna have a bait. We'll just see what we can pull up. Wow, this is beautiful out here. Oh, yeah. I'm just chucking on a little 80 gram Vex jig. It's my favorite. I've caught some snapper on this before. A little bit of a uh, 40 pound mono, just because I can't be bothered tying a new FG. Oh, I'm getting hits. Oh, I'm on. Am I? Yes, I reckon they're cooter. Yeah, they're fighting like barracuda. Which will still take a cooter at this point because um, we need to stock up for bait. Prey season's just around the corner, so it should be nice to get them on board. Here's a cooter. Big fat. Well, not big, but. Just a little one. You picked the wrong boat. Lots of cooter down below. The only sh annoying thing is that they fray the line so much. <laughs> Pump and wide. Pump and wide. What? Double hooked up on some dickies. Oh, a perch. Must have been right down there. Another cooter for me. <laughs> you foul you foul hooked him too. Another cooter for me. And straight in the bin. The old vexed 80 gram jig. The twin assists. Love jigging with twin assists. Midwater or anything? Yep. Ooh. Please don't bite me off. Ooh. All right, there's another one. Here he is. Hello. More bait. It's going slack. Oh, please. All right, that's a better one. Whoa, what's that? It's actually a better fish. Might be. Might be a gurnet. I say it's a better fish, but it's just a dead weight. Oh, you got off. This one's maybe a little bit bigger than the others. Oh, he's out of here. Oh no, I don't want to lose this rig. I'm so worried. <gasps> There's another one. Come back here. Just catching coots. Wow, <laughs> another little boot scooting cooter. And then just slowly like wind it and pop it. Cherry pop it, yep, and wind. There we go. You load up on the chase. What is this? How fun is Cooter? Oh, I can't get my car. Mate, you're going to this other dance party with all your similar mates. If you know the name of this species back at home, please let me know what it is. Oh, if <laughs> one of the big ones. Or fancy not. looking. Yeah. They are fancy. They're a fancy looking fish. They always have these pants on. These fancy pants? Yeah, nothing in comparison to my little poopy cooter. That is a nice big one, isn't it? That one's a bit small. This is like the ultimate um Oh, I feel like I'm six years old and I'm fishing. <laughs> and I'm having a really good time because I'm just catching so many fish. There you go, guys. I think we've got enough cooter. Yeah. It's a good amount of cooter, though. It's, uh... Might go into some shallower water and see if we can 
actually find some flathead. Might give it a go. Well, there we go. We've got plenty of bait for crazy season. That was fun. That was epic. That was so epic. Remember that one cooter I caught? Which one? It the one the that shiny, had like the teeth? The shiny one. That had, had like the teeth on it? That That's why we're just catching cooter. So we're going to see if we can find something else to do. And then we might troll a little bit later on. All right, we've come to some shallower water in search of some flathead. First hook up, and we've got a flatty. <laughs> hey, little fella. Is it 35 centimeters though? I'm not sure. Pushing 30. Wow. All right. See you, buddy. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Come on. Oh, that one's. Oh, might be. Might be. <laughs> Put it in the rod holder, you wallaby. <laughs> Gosh, there's some bait through here. It's unreal. He is probably 30 max. Oh, that was a good wallop. Yeah? Oh. Oh, you know what? Oh, that was a good wallop. This, if this is a flatty, it's a good one. Woo! We might have a keeper flatty here. Please. Oh, yes. Surely. Keeper. Surely that's a keeper. I don't know. I mean, are you saying that guy's a keeper? No, because look, it's not at the very base. Oh, where is it? Where's the base? The base is... Yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> you better get him in the. I don't know if that's a. The wallop on him was amazing. I'm just getting him out of the way. Please! Please! We just want one flathead to take home! What's that? That's still under. Is it? 34. No, he's bending. No, he's not. He's bending that's over. straight. That is still under. Wow! This is going to be so difficult to get a feed of flatties. Oh, oh dear. Three 30 centimeter flatties. Don't forget to like and subscribe, buddy. Take care. Tell you what, it is a bit tricky to find legal flatties nowadays. It is what it is, but. Oh, come on. There he is. Got him. He came back. That one's better. That one's way better. Whew. Way better, but maybe still undersized. Oh, that's why I thought it was better. Because it's bigger and shitter. <laughs> oh, we're off the flatty grounds. Now we're in the, into the poo fish. Here, yeah, flatty, flatty, flatty. Come on. Is this a flatty? This feels like a flatty this time, but... That's another flatty, but is he 35? Like... That's a that's, handsome fish. That's a good size fish, but we just don't know if it's legal. We'll probably struggle. Come here, you wallaby. Get it. Okay. That is still. Oh, that's right on 35. We caught our first flatty! Woo! Oh, there's a small one. Oh, lazy. Very lazy. What's that? That one's. You got one? That one's that one's 30. Oh dear, she's a mission to get some flathead nowadays. <laughs> They're right up the back. I told I That's the worst looking caterpillar I've seen in a long time. Yeah. I feel like this might be a gurnet. Is it a flathead? Woo! This one might be size. Oh hello! See I told you! <laughs> it's about the beer! It's all about the beer. That is 
35 centimetres. We've got two Yay. flathead. Woo! We got two flatties. Now, out of curiosity, what are your thoughts about the flathead rules? Drop a comment down below. We want to know what you think. It is important to us to understand what you think about the rules and regulations. What do you think, Nick? I, I support my government and all its decisions. There you go. Drop a comment down below. 35 centimetres is the legal size now. Bag limits have been cut in half. They're still around, and we understand that we're, you know, managing the stock for the future, but they're definitely a lot thinner than they used to be. Um, and 35 is definitely a lot harder. I don't know what number flathead this is for me, but that's not size. Oh, you got one too. Maybe we should stick, we sticky tape them together. <laughs> sticky tape them together and turn them into a 35er. Oh, this one's nice. It is nice, I can smell it. What is this? I was bloody dealing with your other fish and then I turn around and this is just buckling on the Rodney, Rodney rod holder. This might be another keeper, Nick. Ooh. Look at that. Oh, not, not quiet. Gosh, they're hard. All right, don't forget to like and subscribe, buddy. He'll come right. Send us your friends. Well, of course, I wasn't recording, but we found the flathead of the day, 40 centimeters, and it took a while to find one that big. That was a very lethargic one. Seems like the bigger ones just seem to be super lethargic on the fight. You pull them up and you're like, oh wow, it's actually a big fish or almost size. They just don't have a huge fight to them at the moment. There we go. Jump right on the measuring tape. <laughs> How many centimeters? Hey, I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to help. Ah! Oh, I was worried that was going to happen, man. Like the way you're grabbing that, just. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen, just your angle. <laughs> just grab him by the lips. Oh dear. Yeah. Just, <laughs> just pick him up and throw him away, he deserves it. That was a good one. Gosh, that took a while that time. Another flatty, hopefully. Swimming up with me a little bit, so he could be big. <laughs> just a weird hook set on him. Oh, he's really tangling himself up now. Sorry, bud. Spiky McNo, thanks. Spiky McNo. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, got off. Feed it back down. A couple of jigs on the bottom. Come up and smack it. Where are you? There you are. Slow hook set. That does the trick. Got him. Don't want him to fall out either. Oh, no, this might be a gurnet. Oh, it's a gurnet. Well, maybe. That's a maybe. Yeah? Oh. Yeah, no, that's the wrong angle. Yeah. He's fighting a bit better. Come on. Jig and flatties for days without catching a feed. Ooh, ooh. Closer. Ooh, oh. Nice fish. Come on, it's got to be close, this one. Yes. Woohoo. Right on. Right on the button. All right. On to another one. This one's definitely undersized. They're here, just not in the sizes we want. Oh, there was one following it up. Look at this. That's crazy. He's like, hey, I want to hang out with my friend. Oh my gosh. I thought it was good. <laughs> one of those look all right. The top one looks okay. Burn him up. He might be legal. He might be. Ooh. Close. Looks like a good fish. 
Yes, you are. Got another Lego here. Oh, that was the most lethargic take ever. If that's not a gurnet, that is the biggest flatty we have caught today. Holy hat. Please, please be a flathead because if so, this is a big one. Oh, wowza. Yeah. Whoa, quick, grab the net. Just here. Wow, quick. Oh, he's only just hooked. He's only just hooked. Yeah! <laughs> That's a beast, dude. Oh my god. That's a big toothy tiger. What? It's <laughs> a beast of a fish. That's sick. Wow. That's bigger than those two small ones right there. That's the biggest one I've seen in a while. And it's a, I think it's a tiger. Judging by the teeth. Looks like a leopard. Judging by the spots. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a bizarre take on this absolute donkey. You can see this little, there's a bit of lice on him just on the side there. He's covered in them, so. And this probably is a breeder, but we're gonna keep him. He is infested, so we'll, we'll put him to good use. Uh, or her, whatever it may be. I don't know how to sex them. 50 centimeters. That's right on 50. I haven't caught a flathead that size for a long time on the good old vexed 80 gram jig. Of course, some great fish on this one, but that's definitely a PB. So he's coming home with us. How cool is that? Little lice on there, look at that. I think it, cause it moves, it's weird. <laughs> ah, ah, I don't like it. I can, I can kill that. Oh wow, look at it, hang on. That thing's crazy. Ugh. Dude. What are the odds? I mean, I would not want you to do that. Why does this thing stop rolling? No. Oh, just the screen. Oh, the screen goes. goes. Yeah. Well, there you go. We've got a nice feed of flatties. It's great. Woo. This one might be size. How far we drift off your mark? Oh, fair bit. I'm gonna go back over it. A couple of venison sausages on the go. If you haven't seen where these came from, you've got to watch our hunting video. They are delicious. That is a lunch of champions. Cheers. Well, there you go. Nice little morning on the water. We've had dolphins, whales, flathead, and plenty of barracuda. Did you have fun, Pickle? Dude, it was awesome. <laughs> We're going to clean all of this up, but thanks for hanging out with us. It's been a nice little vlog. And uh, sometimes it's just nice to vlog from the GoPro and enjoy the day. Let's clean this up and we'll see you in the next one. See you later, Wallaby Dick.